In this video I want to talk to you about how to uh, download and install Picasa. Picasa uh, is a photo manager uh, from it's a Google um, application that you install to your computer and uh, it manages your photos and it, you can also uh, make videos um, uh, a video out of your still pictures and uh, add audio to it um, add some title screens things like that so it's a it's a pretty neat little uh, application um, you can also make collages out of photos uh, you could do that for like holiday Christmas pictures I, th I think you'll really enjoy it all right so what I want to do is click Click on the Picasa link in the Moodle, and when I click on Picasa, you'll see um, it's just picasa.google.com. Uh, I'm going to click on Download Picasa, and the version that's out at the time I'm doing this is 3.8. I haven't seen many changes uh, in the last couple versions, so you know it's been pretty much the same. Uh, I'm going to click on Save the File, and this window popped up on my other screen. Uh, it's just downloading Picasa. I'm using Firefox, so I know where that it's going to a downloads folder. You, if you get asked where you want to put it, I would recommend putting it on your desktop. Since uh, I went to my downloads folder, it's just easy for me to right-click on that. I'm going to say Open Containing Folder, and uh, this pops up right now. And right here, I can see the Picasa 3.8 setup. So I'm going to go ahead and double-click on that and tell it to run. and you're just going to progress uh, through the uh, process okay um, say yes you'll get the uh, agreement of course you have to say you agree and then it just wants to know where to install it and you tell it to install and it'll go through the process Um, I don't want to create a shortcut on my desktop. You may want to do that for yourself. I am not going to add it to the quick launch bar. Um, there's no need for Picasa to start up when my computer starts up. So uh, whenever I want to run it, I'll just tell it I want it to run. So I'm going to shut that off. Uh, I already have Google set as my default search engine uh, in Internet Explorer. Uh, you may not want to. I would probably uncheck that if I were you. Uh, and then send an anonymous message of statistics to Google. I'm going to uncheck that as well. They get enough information from me. Again, your decision. And then uh, if you leave this checked and you say run Picasa, when I hit finish, it's going to kick up and start up automatically for me. And it has on my other page. Okay. And so there we are. That's how you download and install Picasa. If you have any questions, please feel free to let me know.